Hi. Hi, Jess. Jess! Have a glass of something that, for legal reasons, must call itself sparkling grape-style drinking wine. Uh, thanks. Have they found some legal way to force me out of the flat? Mark's found a publisher for his book. Brilliant. His book? What next? He's found a director for his film, a builder for his cathedral. Got the email today from BL Books. Very enthusiastic. They've got a slot as long as I can finish my rewrites ASAP. I guess what this shows is hard work pays dividends. Mm, I know what you mean. I was working pretty hard today on my course. Yeah, exactly. Appearing on I'm a Celebrity is not the same as winning an Olympic gold medal. I suppose this means it's all looking up for the old dude brothers, or J.K. Rowling and Sigmund Freud, as we should probably start calling ourselves. So Stephen Redgrave and Timmy Mallet might be more appropriate. I could write a book, piece of piss. Chapter one, the end. There you go, book. So, how was the life coaching? Good. Great, actually. Did a load of great exercises. Pretty sure I won. Not that it's a competition, but it was pretty clear I was the best. Actually, they want me to find a volunteer to practice on. Well, life coach me. I'm a gormless dweeb stuck on the horns of a dilemma. But Dobbs, Game of Thrones? Yeah, we can put the dragon tits on pause, can't we? Just got to nip to the disgustatorium. No need to think about what I'm going to do. Then feel free to coach my ass. Jez, will you please get your filthy hands out of my girlfriend's brain? What? You'd better not be about to tell her to expect more out of life or follow her heart. I'm going to tell her what's right for her. We have a code of ethics. It's a professional discipline. There's a pamphlet. I want to be her life coach. We can't both be her life coach. You can't be her life coach, Mark. You haven't got a certificate. I could if I spent 200 quid and went to Forest Hill for five hours. OK, Jez. Ready? Please, Jez, can you coach her that Simon's a shit and to stop hanging out with him? All right. But I'm warning you, I'm only going to do one unethical thing in my career. It just happens to be the very first thing. Mark's also been working on a book. Oh, OK, cool. I love you, Dobby. Oh, it's, it's nothing. How about if I just pulled my knob out and started wanking? Yeah? Oh, you'd love that, wouldn't you? My gonads out.